Schools Chancellor David Banks held the State of Our Schools address this morning in Brooklyn. CBS 2's Doug Williams covers education for us and has the key takeaways tonight. Mayor Adams and City Schools Chancellor David Banks spoke this morning at the first annual State of Our Schools address at Boys and Girls High School in Bed-Stuy, Brooklyn. The mayor spoke first, painting a picture of a school system dealing with an array of challenges on its own. There's a level of optimism I have every time I walk into a New York City public school. These are challenging moments for us, and I'm concerned. Chancellor Banks spoke almost an hour in a room full of city educators. Today marks the beginning of a very different approach. Chancellor Banks describes this mission as bright starts and bold futures, and a key aspect of that, he says, is teaching city kids how to read. For too long, we have not taught our kids the proper way to read. Banks says starting this school year, phonics and other research-backed strategies will help students not only be able to sound out words, but understand them. Fundamentally, our kids are not literate. When they read by the third grade, I'm telling you, it opens up all the other avenues for success. And when they do not, we have to spend millions and billions of dollars for this program and that program. Banks says in 2022, 51% of students in city schools were not reading at grade level. Safety also amongst the topics discussed, both in and around our schools. Chancellor Banks discussed ongoing plans to lock the front doors of schools and mentioned a stabbing Tuesday outside a school in Brooklyn. Acts of violence, he says, are too often blamed on parents. The kids who decided to stab other kids yesterday, that's our failure. It's our failure. In Bed-Stuy, Brooklyn, Doug Williams, CBS 2 News.